Hi everyone, we're going to look at adding a vignette. It's this lovely dark stuff around the outside. Off, on, off, on. You can add white stuff as well around the outside. Very different effects, but very easy to apply. Let's jump in now and apply a vignette. All right, to apply our vignette, we're going to add um, in my experience uh, timeline. I'm going to drag out a bit of footage. You can drag anything. I'm dragging uh, B005 from bin B. Okay, just make sure your playhead is above it and that the clip is selected. Make sure you can see your Lumetri color panel. Okay, it's this one here under window, and there it is over here. What we might do is just close down everything so that you can see the last one here called Vignette or Viginetti. Okay, I can never spell it when I'm typing it in Google. Even Google's, you know, did you mean? Sometimes it just doesn't. So Viginetti is how I remember it. Okay, and with it selected and down, you've got your clip selected, just drag this top slider to the left, you'll see. And it's that nice kind of darkened edges in here. So dragging it to the left gives you dark, dragging it to the right gives you white ones. And it's probably not the right effect. I feel like it's more of a, uh, you know, like, <laughs> I feel like she might have died. Uh, and this is more of like a recount of her life. Remember when? Okay, and this, dramatic. All right, this could be me. You can uh, play around with the midpoints. Basically, I just leave them. But just so you know, you can kind of stretch it in, stretch it out. Okay, depends on how much you want. Okay, roundness. Let's drag it in there. I'll just show you roundness so you don't have to. Okay, it can be a square vignette or a really round one. Can you see this one? Let's go for amount midpoint. I'm trying to kind of at least show you. There you go. So roundness, okay, do you want it to be like that? Okay, the feather is how blurry it is on the edges. You probably want it pretty high. Okay, and midpoint, let's turn that down so you can see what midpoint does. Okay, you might want to just get the edges. Look at that, just a little hint at it. Okay, it's a weird feature where um, it's, you know, we I edit way too much. I love it. Every video that I ever make, add a vignette. Never a good, it's like lens flare in Photoshop. Okay, when I first learned it, uh, put it on everything, okay? And the problem is, is I've never grown out of that. I just have it on everything. What are the defaults? I can't remember, I'm just gonna stick them all in the middle-ish. Now, we add it as an effect, you know, it, it's kind of a byproduct of old photographs. When you had bad camera equipment, okay, you were forced to have vignettes because it couldn't capture the light and the focus around the outside. We add it now as an effect, okay? So it's up to you. You might hate it, I love it. If you want to turn it off, just turn the little tick off, turn it back on. That, my friends, is a vignette. Known only to me as a virginity, you, you too now. <laughs> I've cursed that word for the rest of your career. You look at it and you'll be like, oh, geez, virginity, I can't spell. All right, that's the end of that one. Let's jump on to the next video. All right, that's it for this video. If you enjoyed it, give the video a like. Consider subscribing to the channel here. And also, if you want to go a bit further with Premiere Pro, consider checking out my Premiere Pro Essentials course. There is a link in the description. Bye now.